Hey guys, welcome to a new game called Remote Sight. Uh, apparently we're doing another late night shift, I think. Let's check it out. I'm going to get run over. No? Okay. Whoa. Uh, okay. I can run. Hey, buddy. Hey. You're very round head. Can I talk to you? Oh. Hello, my name is Jake. What a different name. Anyway, I'm just starting today. You must be Ben, right? Uh, look here. Yes. Hi there, Jake. Yes, glad that you could join us. We have a small crew, but we work hard. Okay. Thanks for the opportunity. I really need this job to pay off my rent. Well, don't we all? Uh, hopefully it works out. I was meaning to ask, is there anything else to do around, well, not including the night shift? Yes, you need to pick up some metal scraps. Morning crew often gets very busy, so a good cleanup afterwards will be appreciated. Alright. Also, you have to get check on the generator. It runs on gasoline, so in case the lights go out, grab the canister near the storage, fill it up. Okay. Once you're done with the task, feel free to rest in the house. A building behind me. No one will bother you till morning. Awesome. Uh, thanks for the heads up. I will not disappoint you, Ben. Great. I will go now. Good luck and keep a sharp eye on that generator. Okay. We got a babysitter generator. Well, here it goes. I think today will be easy. Good place to rest after I do the job. Night one. Alright. I guess this is a generator. Five scraps. This is... Well, there's five here. Oh, yeah, that's not the scrap. Ah, that's probably it. <laughs> Easy job. We can do this. Is this the gas? Yeah. That's three, right? I'm not keeping track. I thought it would keep track. Wait. I hope my salmon is coming back. Yes, it does. Okay, good. But it's kind of funny. It, it runs even if I don't run. <laughs> Take to... Alright. That was easy. Go and rest. Cool. Gotta love easy nights and easy jobs. Nothing bad is ever gonna happen here. Okay, it's too quiet. I don't, I don't like it. It's, I'm getting nervous. Well, okay. Awesome. Night one done. Had a great sleep today. Time for another shift. Pick up eight scraps. Fun. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Three. Four. I guess I can count. Four. Five. Alright, one more. This should be right next to the dumpster. Left that one there intentionally. Alright, so if you run out of stamina completely, you can't run until you fill it fills back up. Good to know. Go and rest. Oh god. Oh thank you. I was like, oh my god, I have to find it in the pitch black. Alright, where's the Where is it? Where was it? Oh, right here, in front of me. Panicking just a little bit. Yes, yes, I got guess. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, okay. All right, we're fine. Yeah, we're good. 
in the house. The chair is the door. Maybe the table. Night two, no problem. Someone is outside. I wonder what they want. Oh, hello. Nice shirt. Is that a... What is that? Hello. Can I help you, man? This is private property and I work here, so just a heads up. Relax. I'm here to help. My name is Philip. I am a private investigator hired by a third party. All right. I investigated the demise of Henry Smith. He was a worker here before you. Did you know him? No. Smith. I know Ben Smith. He's very he's my employer. What happened here exactly? Henry was his brother. They started this remote site business. One day Henry was working and accidentally got burnt real bad. Okay. The pain was so unbearable that on the way to the hospital he died. Witnesses say that Henry was arguing that exact morning with Ben. Why would Ben kill his own brother? That doesn't make sense. They did not agree on many things. Ben was very impulsive, and maybe in the heat of the argument, something snapped. Shit like this happens a lot. Oh, yeah, it's true. If I were you, I would watch my back. I would be back in two days. Meanwhile, maybe you can help me talk to Ben about his brother. No, if he actually killed him, don't bring myself into the middle of it. And why would I want to help you? I can just quit the job tomorrow and I'll be safe. Exactly. Smart man. I know you, Jake. Yes, I did my homework. You need this job more so. You definitely need my protection. So what will we be? I'm sure there's probably other jobs somewhere. Yeah. Ugh. Fine, you prick. I'll do it. I'll take. I'll talk to Ben. But if something goes bad, I promise you will regret my help. We have a deal. Be careful now. And watch out for Ben. He is a primary suspect, after all. I work at a construction site, remember? I'm always careful. Yeah, let's hope so. Feels like I'm in a bad horror game. <laughs> Anyways, no task for today. Maybe I can look around a little. Okay. Feels like I'm in a bad horror game. Oh, okay. I like games that are a little self-aware, you know? Why is there only one? This one is empty. Where are the rest? I should look around. Like a scene talking to the private investigator. All right. Oh, wait. I thought I saw it. I thought I said the curse turned red. Oh. There we go. Oh, what the? Hi. Did he just grunt at me, or... Did he clear in his throat or something? What was that Henry, I wonder? He was, uh, burnt real bad? Maybe he didn't actually die? What the hell was that? I must talk to Ben tomorrow. Yeah, I, I, I probably would talk to him. Yeah. Alright. Night three. What is with his hand? Not the lobster claw one. The one that looks like a saw. They did not show up this morning. Same freaking night shift at the end. Night four with a red four. That's probably okay. 
Now red's always a good color to see. Like scraps. Okay, maybe I should actually look for a scrap now. Why do I hear... What is that? What is that? Stop that. Three, I think. I wasn't really counting this time. Four, I think. Five. Okay, yeah, there's six. I saw one over here. Go and rest. Ooh, what? Okay. Okay. We're fine. All right, go to bed. Uh, what the? You scared me. We need to talk. Why did you hide the information about Henry? That's subtle. It was none of your business, Jake. I see you talked to the investigator about the case. Too bad. Look, I do not want any trouble. All right, I will do my job and let us forget about it. I know you did nothing wrong, but I did though. I caused the accident that killed Henry. I didn't need to know this. I killed this pathetic ass. He was weak and naive. He was going to accept an offer from a competing company. What a loser. So I did what was necessary because he owned half of all this. Ugh. Feels so good to finally admit this. I feel much better now, Jake. I feel free and excited again. Oh, please don't. But I do feel bad for you. You seem like a good guy, a hardworking guy, and it's such a pity to see you go now in an accident just like Henry. Wait, wait, wait. We can discuss this. I am I am a simple guy. I will not tell anyone. I promise, Ben. Behind you. No discussions, Jake. Your contract has been terminated. You are fired. Oh, 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 you didn't, I didn't know. Uh, firing signatures on the thing. I thought he was just gonna kill his brother and I'll be, be it. Is he still behind me? Oh yeah, he's there. Why would this work? Is this working? Oh! Oh! Well, that works better than a fire extinguisher. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. We've got a lot of work to do. I told you to watch your back, but you had to play the hero. Thanks to me, you are alive. Actually, no, thanks to you, I almost died. My head, what happened exactly? Did you catch that thing, whatever it was? Well, the good news is that you are alive and we have identified the rip saw, the thing you're referring to. It was Henry, all alive and active. With that half a head. Rip saw, who came up with that shit? <laughs> did you or did you not catch Henry? Listen up here, asshole. I saved your life back there. Maybe a thank you, Mr. Philip, and kiss my ass while I'm at it, huh? I did not catch Henry. I hit him with the car, got out, then I saw you and tried to help out. While I was calling the backup, he suddenly disappeared. End of story. Alright, I'm sorry. And I'm thankful, really. It's just that I'm afraid he'll show up again. He definitely will. But like I said, this is the end of my story. Ben is dead. Henry is out there. My job is done, Jake. 
Okay. Great. I'm left here with no job, bruised with no recommendation letter. You might as well shoot me. I kind of disagree. What would you say about working for me? You look strong, and after all this, I might need you for another case as well. What? Bait? Are you serious? Of course I will do the job. And I highly doubt that there is something worse out there right now. Yeah. Shouldn't have said that. You think? Picture this then. A young woman goes to the cemetery, visiting her mom, who passed away. Then she meets an elder man. Turns out the guy had a basin full of bodies and tapes. At least they're still searching for him. What do you say, partner? I'm gonna go look for, like, a nice desk job somewhere. I am in! Sure! Alright, well, that was, uh... A remote site. Interesting little short game. Um, if you want to check it out, it'll be down in the description. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments, and I'll catch you on the next one. Thank you.